Hi everyone, this is Tracy from Fairy Crafts. Uh, I'm just showing you an altered box that I did lately. Uh, this box, it's just a cardboard box. I think some of the some of my kids got something in it at Christmas time, jewellery or something. And because it was nice and sturdy, I thought, well, I'll keep it and I might be able to use it for something. So finally found it lurking at the back of the cupboard. So I thought, right, I'm going to alter it. So I painted the inside white, uh, top and bottom, and then I painted the bottom and the outside white as well, and then dry brushed it with some brown acrylic paint. Uh, the top I left a darker brown, didn't put white on it, just did a dark brown, and then I inked it with some gold, don't know if you can see that, just to distress it a bit. And the bottom, I tied a ribbon that I had in my stash all the way around it. And I had this, this tinsel-y kind of ribbon. Uh, and I just wound it round in a circle and stuck it on the front. On the lid, I did the same again. Wound it round in a circle and stuck it on. This leaf ribbon is from the local craft shop. And you get it in a couple of different colours. If you'd seen the video of my bird houses that I've done, you'll see it in one of them as well. The paper lace came from Norway. Uh, I actually bought some more of it when I was over last week staying with Vicky from Sticky Vicky Crafts. And I really like it. It's very pretty. I've got a couple of different styles and thicknesses. That I've got up really nice. Uh, a Tim Holtz added sticker which I distressed with ink around the edges and some Tim Holtz paper on the top some I am roses roses which I inked with brown because they were just plain white but I uh, inked them and a couple of wooden buttons that I've got in my stash I've got a crazy amount of buttons and I really need to start using them uh, when I was over last week, Vicky said something about, oh, did I want buttons, or we were somewhere and I, she picked up buttons, and I says, oh, I don't want buttons. I have so many buttons that I don't know what to do with them. So if anybody wants buttons, please let me know, and I could send you some. Uh, and this butterfly came from I Am Roses as well, if I remember rightly. I've got quite a few different colours and styles of them. And they've got a little furry body and little bead eyes and tiny little feelers. You can't really see them. But they came like that. So I stuck it down and I just bent the wings up to make it look like it was sitting on top of the box. And that's my altered box. So I hope you like it. And thanks for watching. Bye.